Hey guys, so happy Christmas Eve, 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 Eve. Uh, I'm gonna open my advent calendar, four sleeps to go, and it is a Christmas pudding. Um, so yeah, I wanna say about something that sounds pretty exciting for you guys. The makers of the film Chronicle are asking YouTubers, what are you capable of? And I thought I'd get involved too. All you have to do is post a video response to this video answering the question, what are you capable of? And the big film chiefs are gonna make a short film of all the best entries, which is pretty cool. So I was thinking, what am I capable of? And I decided to test myself by doing something life-changing and world-altering and brilliant. Am I capable of baking? <laughs> what? I fell over again. My Pikachu is itchy. Oh. Pika! So today we are making Christmas cookies. And whose recipe are we following? Have a guess. Delia Smith! Yeah! Here she is flying into the kitchen now. Oh Delia. Oh Delia. I'm a bit excited. I've never baked anything before, so this is my first time. <laughs> so you could say that Delia's gonna take your baking virginity? You could say that, yeah. Oh, Delia. So for this recipe, you will need... 225 grams of plain flour. Fresh from the hairdryer. Not again. <laughs> 110 grams of castor sugar. Castor sugar. 110 grams of cold butter, chopped. One medium dinosaur egg. Chicken fetus. Icing materials. Baking paper. And a mixing bowl. Food colorings. Optional. A broken mixing device. Thanks, Tesco's. Firstly, preheat the oven to 180 degrees centigrade. But get an adult to help you Ooh. if you're eight. Also, that's 350 degrees Fahrenheit. I know things. Ah. So Delia suggested we use a food mixer, but we don't have one, so we're using a broken whisk. Oh my god, that's scary. Ah. <laughs> and also a wooden spoon. Pure manpower! And that's terrifying. Pour all 225 grams of flour into your bowl. Wah! Add your 110 grams of sugar. Woo. Chop up 110 grams of butter. No! No, I'll never be the prince of the butter kingdom. The signs of a psychopath waiting to happen. Globular. So you want to mix all these together until they resemble fine breadcrumbs. Now I've got no idea how this is going to work with a wooden spoon, <laughs> uh, but let's go for it. Yeah! 410 hours later. I take inspiration from Disney. How do you pass time? How? By singing a song. Left to right, right to left. Everybody's whisking up and down. Back and forth, up and down. Everybody's whisking Delia Smith's face. Oh my god! When will it end? When will it end? Uh. <laughs> the broken whisk of Kazakh doom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is doing loads. The fork of justice singing through the night. Don't stab me in the hat. <laughs> Breadcrumbs, breadcrumbs everywhere, everyone is eating bears. Is this baking video gonna unintentionally turn into a full length album? I think so. Oh, ah! oh. Sorry, don't do that. At this point you should have a delicious smell coming out of the bowl. Although we've already added the flour so it's past the point of tastiness. And 415 hours later... We has breadcrumbs! Delia, uh, you're the one for me. What? <laughs> Once you have the breadcrumbs, crack an egg into the bowl. Here we go. Egg. Be what? Sorry. I didn't even drop it though. Stop. Work. Buttery hand. Stop. Stop. Fill. That was perfect. No eggshell. And a teaspoon of water. Now you have to mix it until it becomes a ball. Really? Yeah. Ooh. I'm guessing it's going to be like a football. Bulbasaur. Congealing all the stuff. Egg, egg, egg. It's the king of all yolks. Is Delia some like epic Robotron or something? How does she do yeah, this? I think she is. She is the Delianator. After stirring it for a while, you can use your hands to make your ball. It's a breakfast bar stool. It's a breakfast bar stool. I don't think this was going to make it onto the album, Dan. No. <laughs> a Japan exclusive bonus track. Yes. Yes. Flowering the surface. So get your ball nice and flowery. Ah! <laughs> I thought you were going to hit me with the head like a psychopath. I did, but the camera's rolling. Okay, so get your bowl nice and flowery so it's not sticky anymore and you can throw it around like this, like a pizza. So now if you want colours, you want to separate the mixture into different sections. This will be our green section. I've done this slightly wrong and you were probably meant to add the food colouring at the same time as the egg, but let's just add it Let's anyway. just get permanently green hands. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Oops, oh god. Okay. Now it's time to roll it out into a neat flat surface. <laughs> Die! They have feelings! Die! They have feelings! Die! Roll it out so it's about the thickness of a one pound coin. For Americans, that's about three ants on top of each other, would you say? Uh, yep. Yeah. yeah, like about that thick. This section would be a lot better if I had cleavage. Lightly grease your baking tray. Grease? Yeah. You mean lubricate? Lubricate. 
We made Australia. Now cut them into any size you want. It's preferable you've got a cookie cutter, but we just have a giant knife. Add your cookies to the baking tray. What is that gonna be? You'll find out. So on tray one we have a llama, a mystery, a cracker, a bauble, a fail whale, a snowflake, a... Star thing. Star thing, a P and a caterpillar. And on tray two we have a lion face, a snowman, a D, an earth, a house, a... What was that? I don't know. A thing and a tree and a gnome. Now put them in the oven, one on the top shelf, one on the middle shelf for 10 to 15 minutes and then swap them around halfway through, about a 7 minute mark. There you go my babies. Feeling hot, hot, hot. I just realised our windows are open and the whole neighbours oh see God. us. <laughs> it's not advisable to make these cookies in your favourite jeans. Do -do -do -do! They're ready! Oh, they look really good. They're kind of slightly overcooked, but they still look tasty. I think it's time to decorate them. Dan, come look! Yeah. Oh, they turned out so much better than I thought they'd do. Your fail whale looks awesome. I know, right? <laughs> oh, that's good. Um, I thought they were all going to be disasters. Yeah, I like my snowman as well. But come on though, who actually thought that my llama would turn out okay? That's really Look at cute. it. You've got a <laughs> planet Earth. Cata biscuit. <laughs> it's time to commence the decorating. Yeah! It's like the Sistine Chapel, but better. I am quite proud of our creation. I am too. I was honestly expecting them to be a lot more of a disaster, but they're actually quite fit. Yeah, so it turns out I am capable of making cookies. Yes! Almost hit my head on the ceiling then. <laughs> Although, don't you want to know what the uh, mystery cookie is? Yeah, what is that? So what do you think it is, Phil? Uh, spaghetti bolognese? It is a placenta! No! A placenta cookie! Oh, of oh course! God. You can eat that one then. I will. Weirdly, that looks like the tastiest cookie as well. How many Christmases out of ten? Mm -hmm. Twelve. Do you want me to leave you in a room Soft with and shit. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, cookies aside, oh... Really mm. good, yeah? Mmm! That's right, Delia knows how to hit the spot. Oh yeah. Cookies aside, I wanted to tell you about our radio show. Ah! Ah! Me and Dad have been given a two hour show on BBC Radio 1 on Christmas Day. Yep, and this won't just be a radio show, will it, Phil? Oh. It's going to be two hours of video. On the Radio 1 website. It's on Christmas Day between 10 and 12 p.m. So we're not going to interrupt anything important, you'll finish your dinner, you'll be like, ah, time to watch <laughs> Phil and Dan for two hours. It's going to be the best. Dan, you can leave now. Oh. 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 Uh, hey! <laughs> These aren't just normal Christmas cookies. These are freaking Delia Smith Christmas cookies. The minute you walked in the joint, and uh, Dan. <laughs> okay. <laughs>